Hello everybody! Welcome back to my channel. I'm super excited to have you guys here today for yet another video. <laughs> Been on a filming kick this week. I've filmed like five videos so far. Um, but this one's really exciting because guess what finally came in the mail? The August with Fox. Um, so I am super excited to show you guys this. I'm sure you guys have probably already seen a few people. Um, this was actually like a Scentsy Club order. It was a part of the Scentsy Club order. Um, I have since removed it because I've decided that if I do want to get with boxes, I think I'm just going to go ahead and order them on the first of the month um, because I don't like to wait. Um, this was processed on the 14th and today is, let me look at my watch, today is the 26th. So it's been 12 days since it was processed. Um, so it took a while to get here and I obviously have seen spoilers. Um, <clears throat> But I, for future months, I don't want to wait. So if I want the Whiff box um, for that month, I think I'm just going to go ahead and order it. That was another thing about the fall and winter catalog that's really nice is that the Whiff box is now available for any type of purchase. It doesn't have to be included in your Scentsy Club anymore. Anyways, I'm going to stop talking about that. <laughs> um, I have already opened this. First of all, I've already seen spoilers, so I knew what was supposed to come in it. More on that later, though. Um, and I wanted to unpackage like the bars because I didn't want to have to do that in the video, but I do think it's fun to kind of like unbox it with you guys. So let's just jump right in. <clears throat> oh, what did I hit? <laughs> I don't know. I hit something. Okay. So typical, it says the scent with love thing. It's just a normal with box. Um, and we get this little flyer sort of thing that has a bunch of different lists in it that you can like fill out yourself. Um, so there's like things for birthdays and events, things to not forget. So like if there's something you always buy more of, but you don't have it in your Scentsy Club, you could put that there. Um, scents you really like and you need to stock up on. I like that one. I think this is cute. Will I use this? Maybe not, but it is cute and it's like kind of a fun idea. Like maybe I'll make notes like this um for all catalogs so that's cute and it has like a picture of the front of the catalog on it as well um we also got a catalog in this one um another catalog for me but uh yeah it's a nice just regular catalog i think the canada folks got um the one in english and one in french so just fun fact <laughs> i didn't get one in french and then we have a bunch of full-size products um, we also forgot to mention these, some samples. These are in lemon verbena dish soap. I do really like the dish soap. I've been using the squeeze the day dish soap and I love it. I actually need to do it in my dishes. So maybe I'll use this one, um, today. Um, these are actually pretty hefty samples too. Like, honestly, I, you could probably use like one full packet for like an entire sink full of dishes. So that's pretty awesome. And then, like I said, the rest of the box is just a bunch of full-size products. Um, so let's just jump right in to the full-size, the fun stuff. We have Around the Campfire Scent Circle. I don't know how I feel about this scent. Some people are saying it compares to Marshmallow Fireside. I don't get a sweet aspect to it. So to me, it doesn't compare to Marshmallow Fireside from Bath & Body Works. Um, it's a pretty smoky scent but my boyfriend might like this in his car so i'll see if he wants that one for his car i also don't think the scent circles are super strong in the car um but one place that i really like to put them and i have been putting them is in my closet um i just hang it like on the the hanging rack and it's really nice every time i open the door to my closet i get like a whiff of that fragrance um i haven't noticed it like making my clothes smell like that or anything but it just is nice because you know sometimes closets can get kind of like musty when they're just closed up all the time um okay so let's talk about the cozy cardigan scentsy soak i have never tried scentsy soak i'm so excited <laughs> like i was this is what i was looking forward to the most i think and I am a total wax and warmers person too, but this giant bag of Cozy Cardigan was what I was looking most forward to. So I'm going to open it and smell it because I can't wait. Ooh. Oh, that just went everywhere. <laughs> oh yeah, that is nice. I really like that. 
Um, I am going to be buying more of these for sure. I like that they're in a resealable bag and not like a bath bomb. Um, bath bombs are a little bit more fun, let's be real, because they kind of fizz and, you know, have some fun to them. Um, but those are like great as gifts too, because it's, you know, you can choose how much you want in there at one time and you don't have to try to like cut a bath bomb in half or anything like that you can just kind of take a few scoops or if you want a lot you can do a lot um whatever you want to do so that is the cozy cardigan scentsy soak it smells super good i don't know if this has the notes on it but it is kind of like a musky sweet floral scent Oh, it does have the notes. <laughs> Soft suede, blushing rose, and amber silk. Yeah. So I don't get a ton of rose necessarily. Like, I, I can't say that it's rose. Um, it's just kind of like a sweet, feminine, perfumey floral. So, okay. Then the last thing in the box is four full-size bars. So this is the sad moment for me. If you guys have seen the spoilers too, or if you've already got yours, most of the boxes, or at least all the videos that I saw, came with a breakfast and bed Scentsy bar. I already have a breakfast and bed Scentsy bar because I ordered it when we, uh, as soon as we could, but I was super looking forward to having another one. I did not get a breakfast and bed Scentsy bar. Um, they were sold out, so I kind of wonder if that has something to do with it. Obviously, it probably does. But the second part of that is I thought the reason why it took so long for my Scentsy box, for my Whiff box to ship out was because they were waiting for those breakfast and bed bars to come back in stock. Now they're in stock, I believe. Um, but I guess that wasn't the case because I don't have a breakfast and bed Scentsy bar in this box. Oh, well, it's fine. Clearly surprises are not for me. <laughs> so the first one is Aloe Vera and Ivy, the scent of the month. If you guys have watched more than like one of my videos, you'll know I really like this. To me, I smell watermelon. Wow, look at that. It's like a perfectly clean bar. It has like no bubbles in it. I smell watermelon. I smell a green watermelon scent and I love watermelon. So this is a really great fragrance. I've already put it in my Scentsy Club. I love the aloe vera and ivy. Not mad about having another one of those. Next one is Autumn Road Trip. It's like this nice bright orange wax. I love this scent. So this is exactly what you think fall smells like, kind of. It's apple-y, it's kind of sweet like, like that, like with the apple one, I believe there's pear in this as well. And then there's also like almost a masculine cologne woods note, but that doesn't overpower it. It's very nicely blended between the sweetness of the apple and the pear, and then that woods note. So that's Autumn Road Trip. Excited to have another bar of that one. I already have that one too. Um, apples and Oats. Or is it Apple and Oats? Apple and Oats. This is a brown wax. This is one that has surprised me. I really like this one like way more than I thought I was going to just based on the scent notes alone. It's Apple and Oats. Um, it's like a creamy buttery oat. A sweet cinnamon apple. I've seen a few people compare this to like the apples and cinnamons Quaker oatmeal, like the instant oatmeal that you pour in the bowl. Um, and I, I think that that's probably pretty spot on. I'm super excited to warm this. I'm actually excited to have another bar of this so I can get to warming it right away. And it's not a spicy cinnamon. It's a very sweet bakery cinnamon. Um, I have seen a few people say that this is like missing a little something for them. And I think that you totally could mix this with literally pretty much everything if you think it's missing bakery throw in the next bar i'm going to talk about all my croissant or if you think it's missing apple throw an apple and cinnamon sticks you could throw in johnny apple seed if you guys have that it's not available anymore unfortunately but yeah i really like that one i'm super i think this might be one of the next ones i warm i'm really excited about that one and then i have almond croissant super excited about that I do like this scent a lot. Um, oh, I broke it. I was trying to take it out. So to me, this is like a very sweet, buttery bakery. And then you do get like a, a definite like almond extract kind of scent. Um, yeah, I don't get cinnamon sugar. I think that is in the scent notes, but I don't get cinnamon. I get like a buttery pastry kind of scent. 
and then almond and I really like it I'm excited to warm this one I haven't tried this one out yet um I have heard that it's actually not super like it's not not strong it's not weak um but on cold sometimes when I smell it, I'm like that sounds like it might be a little bit weak um, but I've heard good things about it. So I'm excited to warm almond croissant as well. That is everything that came in the August whiff box. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that if you guys got your whiff box, you got everything that you were hoping for in it. Um, I believe the whiff box is still available, but anyways, that's it for this video. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.